Hello everybody, welcome back to Gamer TA. Or today we just found a sheep that seemed to have escaped the enclosure somehow. Like you do not know the level of confusion I have here. Come on this way, you need to go back to your pen. How did you escape the pen? Like, what? How? Okay, where are... Oh, there are the sheep. Oh, goodness. Does it run off? Ugh. They're so annoying. Why? Why? How did you escape? How? What? How did you escape? <laughs> okay. Are you able to, like, clear this jump? No, you can't. How did you get out? How on earth did you escape? Oh wait, I'm pretty sure last episode I sheared, I made a sheep outside of the pen blue and then sheared it and now it has its wool back. That's what happened. Oh. Well, the sun's going down, I should probably head back to base. But speaking of the base, I'm thinking we should probably continue upgrading it. Like, I really like the little wool overhang we've done. It also makes me wish that we, that survival players had access to the debug stick so that this doesn't connect to this. But, oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, do I? I'm going to make a boat to fight the Enderman. Because that's a pretty good tip. Use boats to fight Endermen so that you can just stick them on. Speaking of the Enderman, where is the Enderman? Yes. Oh, no. That did not terrify me at all. That is not terrifying me at all. I don't like that. Where is the Enderman? Where is the Enderman? Boat. Where's the Enderman? Huh. <sighs> this is extremely stress inducing. Where is the Enderman? Ender boy. Where are you? Where on earth is the Enderman? Uh, I'm so confused. Where is it? Where it just disappeared. How did you get up? Well, I guess that proves that not just clerics can get up there, since that's the only way they could have gone up there. But I'm looking. Where did the Enderman go? Like it's gone. Like. I'm so, I, it's just disappeared. I'm so confused. Well, um, that's a bit off topic now. Well, I did just get a bunch of wood. I'm thinking, 
should I set up a nice little? I'm gonna set up like a bakery oh. next to the next to the next to this area, and then this Nitwit villager will actually have a job. Some good wood or logs, whatever. I think this is coming together really well. I just need more wood. More wood, because this this does not really look that well without more things keeping it up since like that's like a pro builder tip. Never make never make things that are floating. Never. Unless you're trying to prank your friends by just leaving up floating trees everywhere. Or if you're trying to make some kind of abstract whatever thing, some kind of abstract thing. But most of the time, if you're trying to make a real nice looking build, just, just make it not floating. Just get the extra little support blocks. It'll really go a long way to make it look better and that's why oh come on am I, am I not oh, I'm out of logs again man this stuff is this like I don't even know what to say about that I, I'm oh it's always the materials I need the most that I don't have wait do I have logs in my chest and I'll probably explain why my inventory is so empty. This villager... I feel... You know, should I just leave him there? I don't have logs. I do have dripstone. Ooh, yes. Please tell me this isn't the one I mined earlier. It's not. Mine wood. My wood. My wood. My goodness. Bread is not. Bread is an easy food to farm, but it doesn't seem like it's the best food source. Or maybe that's just because I'm running too much. <laughs> now. You know what? I'm gonna do this nitwit a favor and give him a place to have a job. Yeah. I crafted way too many slabs. I crafted way uh -huh. too many slabs. Yeah. Get down for them. Yeah. Suspended midair somehow. Are you gonna take the job? You gonna? Huh. Eh? It's like they always they always take the jobs I don't want them to take. But when I actually want them to have a job, they never take the job. Like, come on, come on! Huh. But I do like the way that this is looking. This does look really, really nice. Huh. I mean, just just look at it. Look great. I'm just gonna add a little thing. Well, oops. little thing here. It's perfect. It's it's nice and perfect. This this is the best build I've ever made. Totally. <laughs> totally. This is totally the best build I have ever made. Yeah, totally. Seriously, but this is a nice little overhang here. How did you get up there again? 
Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. What were those green pa particles about? Yeah. What? Please don't tell me he thinks that his that my bed is now his bed. Oh, it's mutton. I have mutton here. What am I doing? Wait a oh. This this is <laughs> this is the disadvantages of li living somewhere where you can't. Uh, wait, why am I making trap doors to a? Uh, Wait, that would that would kill two birds with one stone. The villagers would stop climbing up there, and the rain will stop coming through. I think it'll stop coming through. I hope it'll stop coming through. Doesn't make sense, but it works. It makes absolutely no sense that that thing is not letting in any water, but it works, and that's all I really need. Well, I really think I really think this has been a very nice productive episode, right? What do you think, guys? I think it's, I think it's been nice and productive, hasn't it? <laughs> well, oh my goodness again! How do you keep getting up there? Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. Forgot about uh -huh. that. Uh -huh. I completely uh -huh. forgot about that. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Well, that's it for today, everybody. Bye bye, and uh -huh. have a nice day, everybody.